framing your search using Pico or turning a challenge into a clinical question into a search strategy. Where do you start? A challenge to your current knowledge is an opportunity to ask a question and find an answer. By recording and reflecting on your workplace challenges, you become a lifelong learner and a valuable employee. Let's use an example. I saw Mrs X today. She has mixed urinary incontinence. Usually I'd suggest pelvic floor training for stress incontinence and bladder training for urgency incontinence. Because she has both stress and urgency incontinence, I didn't know whether to treat them both or at once or at the same time. In the end, I asked her which was more troubling and treated it first, but I don't know if that was the best thing to do. So, what questions could we ask? They could relate to prevalence or prognosis. But really, this is a question about treatment. To frame a question, use PICO. What is PICO? A method for building a question using P for population. Start with the person in your challenge. How can I describe this person to find the best studies? Plus I for intervention. Sometimes E for exposure. What will they be exposed to? How can I best describe the treatment? Then C for comparison. What is the main thing I want to compare this exposure or intervention with? Also O for outcome. What do I want to change or accomplish? What will this exposure really affect? And finally, T for time. When do I want to see this effect? That's population, intervention or exposure, comparison, outcome and time. For some questions, you'll only need a population, intervention or exposure and an outcome. or sometimes a population, intervention, outcome and a time. Using the example, the PICO would look something like this. The next step is brainstorming your PICO. To prepare for the research process, it's important to look at the ideas and words in your PICO. Are there any synonyms, regional spellings, broader terms, narrower terms? Write it down. For example, for intervention, even better, make another column for your brainstorm terms. Once you've done your brainstorm, you're ready to build your search using the magic words and and or. The best way to search your PICO? Search either your population combined with your intervention, outcome or both. Depending on the number of search results, then add your comparison or time to further narrow your search. For more, visit the Wellington Medical and Health Sciences Library, University of Otago.